Duck hunters are calling this year's season a success despite increased regulation and the closure of some wetlands. But it is a tale of two seasons, with the Coalition Against Duck Hunting witnessing an industry down on its knees. With the season over, the ducks are in the clear, but hunters still have a target on their back. Duck shooters were breaking the law. They were illegally shooting more than one bird at a time. They weren't bothering to retrieve them. Tighter regulations on opening weekend, the closing of a number of swamps and dry conditions contributed to a subdued season. It was a season that started with a, with a lot of anticipation and it sort of filtered away to be a, a very slow, quiet opening and it was a very slow lead into the season. Field and game were largely impressed with hunter behaviour despite an alleged airboat incident currently under investigation by the Game Management Authority. They are designed specifically for, for wetlands that are very shallow and they were scaring birds up into the guns. From what I understand from people that were there is the boat was unpowered uh, and as it was they were dispatching a bird and collecting a wounded bird as per the regulation state. Activists say the unusually quiet season despite high bird numbers is telling. Duck shooting will be banned and the government will introduce nature-based tourism to regional Victoria in a big way. Meanwhile, hunters say they want the government to lock in the next season early. In recent years, it's um, actually made its way into early January. For industry, that is just, uh, it's incredibly difficult to manage and diff difficult to organise. Tyrone Kennedy, Win News.